Hello everyone, welcome back to another video and you may be slightly confused, you're like I've never heard her talk before and yes this is my voice reveal exclusive um, and I just wanted to make a video about Dido Bell so I'm going to be recreating a painting of her today so on with the video so just before I start talking about Dido Bell and her life, I just want to give a quick info about what I'm doing. So this painting of Dido Bell and her second cousin, Elizabeth, is um, a painting by David Martin and is quite unusual for its kind. Typically any painting with a black person in it from the 18th century would show them as a slave and would show them to be below their master and often these black people would look up to their masters. Instead, Dido is looking at the view, which is obviously atypical of the time. Also, as you saw earlier, this painting has both Elizabeth and Dido. I've just done Dido by herself. Sorry, Elizabeth. Dido Bell was a British heiress born in 1761, so the mid-Georgian era. She was born into slavery, her mother, Maria Bell, being an African slave in the Caribbean. Unfortunately, little is known about her. Her father was a British naval officer who was stationed there. He took Dido back with him to England and placed him under the care of his uncle, Lord Mansfield. Dido grew up alongside her second cousin, Elizabeth Murray, and the pair got on extremely well. Dido worked as an amanuensis, a literary or artistic assistant for her great uncle, which reflects her education and abilities. Her great uncle, Lord Mansfield, was Lord Chief Justice and was in a significant slavery case, finding in 1772 that slavery had no precedent in common law in England and had never been authorised under positive law. Dado married John de Vinier in 1793 and they had at least three sons. Unfortunately, Dado died in 1805 at the young age of 43. Two years after her death, in 1807, the Slave Trade Act was passed, which banned the slave trade in the British Empire. However, it took until 1833 to slavery to be actually abolished in Britain. So if you want to learn more about Dido, go watch these YouTube videos and also watch the 2013 movie Belle. But to be honest, I haven't watched it in a long time and I don't know how accurate it is. If you want more history videos, firstly, I hope to be making more in the future. Secondly, the Lindsay Holiday YouTube channel is really great. My favourite videos of hers are the videos she discusses LGBT kings and queens. So thanks so much for watching.